and um, got a fill up and a wash. We're over near the ABC supermarket. Like it's a robot. It's a robot. Robot wash. Super slow. Takes forever. It's sort of filthy in here. You can see the inner workings of this mechanism. Soft glass, soft gloss max. Blowers are going. You can see the vent right there. drive. I think we're done. There's no green light. I think it's broken. But we're leaving. And, uh, now we're in the little Saigon. Probably at not, I would say the heart. One of the hearts of the little Saigon. One of the more populated areas. The bus comes here and picks up travelers that go north to northern California. This is the bus sort of bus pickup area. There's the ABC supermarket. Um, the guys are in the Rex hair salon getting their hair cut. So let's go park here.
inside and dry everything off. take a clay to it. It's pretty dirty. Got all these, these seats. Okay, so I got the keys, the wallet. Let's look at that. Ugh. Wiping my mirrors. So, yeah, just a typical evening Ubering of the family to the hair salon. And while I'm waiting, chauffeuring I try to do something you know make the best of the time so I either try to do things that uh, I guess it didn't blow it didn't blow it out very good there's a bunch of junk here this other side How those brushes didn't get those other little pollen, like these little pollen droplets? They sh the brushes should have got them, but I don't know how it did. It's, it's beautiful. It's always kind of nice right here. Uh, the weather's perfect. Not too close to the beach. Uh, where you get that marine layer and the salt, that salty kind of air. It's a nice breeze. I think I waxed this the last time, the whole car, so everything's drying up pretty good. See this here? I don't know how it didn't get that. Uh, yeah, about to take the Volt to summer camp uh, west of Tahoe. So gas prices are up, and so that's a that's a reason. Another reason is I just you know I've never taken it on a long trip that long. The longest is Santa Barbara. Um, so we'll see how it does going. Actually, we're going all the way up to Shasta Caverns, which is um, north of Redding, uh, above Lake Shasta. That's that's as far north as we're going. It's probably going to do about 1,400 miles starting this Friday, this weekend, coming up on the 4th of July holiday weekend. This weekend, it's going to be on the road. Uh, yeah. On the 4th, we're heading into camp. We're arriving on Sunday in camp. So, staying um, at like a Hilton Inn kind of place, north, near the airport, north of Sacramento. So, something smells good over there. Like, sort of like this beefy st 
gooey smell. Well, it's drying up pretty good. Try to get all, get all this stuff here. I always like to, even though, you know, they say it's, the car's gonna get dirty on a road trip, I always like to clean it before we go and then sort of leave it dirty after we come back. <laughs> just leave it there. <laughs> I don't know why. They say you should just leave it dirty and clean it when you come back, but uh, when it sits in front of your house, you don't really, you know, look at it or are in it and around it. So, you know, it doesn't really matter if it's dirty. But when you're on a road trip and uh, you need it to be clean uh, for somewhat safety purposes, but it's just nice to have it clean, clean vehicle when you're in it and going around in it, that sort of thing. So yeah, I always clean my, get my vehicle ready and clean it right before a long trip. So I don't know why this area in the back always gets kind of like messed up. It's gonna be something I can do about that. under part of it. Looks pretty good. Well, I'm uh, just going to continue drying here. If you're watching, thanks for watching. It's uh, another typical day. I think it's June the 30th, 2021. Tomorrow will be, we'll enter into July. So half of 21, 2021 is over. Some kind of seedling pot in there. And uh, we're good. coming out of the pandemic. Uh, it was, it was a kind of a long and situation, compromise situation. So, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.